Because I've chosen the quiet life after all. No blaze of glory for me. Never been better. Sure don't look it. I can't let you on! Hey, hey, we're chill! Tonight, I'm... I'm here to say goodbye to all of you. Money's money, can't fuck around with it. Speaking. Uh-huh. You're wasting your lives following us around like dogs. How much We're crawled up on? your ass. Okay. I want it today. Johnny! Wait up! Don't do this! You could still change your mind. Want to see me give up? Sounds like something you'd do. Know why? Because you've always been a fucking pussy, Carrie. Offer you one piece of advice, for all time's sake. Stop being one. Time to bring on the future.
Armin, let gravity do its thing. Explosion rocks the foundation, tower crumbles, chaos, screaming roll credits. Exit window's gonna be tight. Jacking in. It's grass green, birds fly, can't see bats, rats, shit, gnats. Mainframe's not your playground, Murphy, come on. Evac announcement. Broadcast it across all frequencies and let's get moving. Sheesh. Who wrote this manifesto? Really need me to answer that question? Jesus, Johnny. You've gone off the deep end. That's coming from a chair jock. Come on! Contact! Contact! Get ready! Only okay, one way to go! Forward! Pachito 2, Bomb's name is what? Wrap it up! We got a Delta! The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shaka Elite incoming! There, Run Johnny. for it! Shoot the cables! Get the rotor spinning! We're on our way! Not done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. never about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand, Rogue. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door lock breached. Arasaka sons of bitches incoming. Love you, Spider. All world loves me. in on the access point. Slide in. Sweet icebreaker. Foreign, right? Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. Hilarious. You gonna help or not? Do spiders spin webs? It's time we caught some flies. Thanks, Murph. Now, just for good measure. Holy cyber cow. We're on TV. Take a look. Turn now to Arasaka Tower. 
Its evacuation ongoing after an unidentified terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorists stating their desire to, quote unquote, topple a monument to corporate colonialism. Night City's mayor, Imbole Ebunike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. They're moving up. Hit the roof quick. Johnny boy, told you I'd end you someday. Try once more. Your associates. Who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <sighs> Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire fistful material? <sighs> Don't look too pleased with your efforts. Let's see. Joke says, Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness, you freak. Hajimiro.
And you, who are you? than he looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So let's you and me figure this out. Arasaka-sama, I was able to kill you. I was able to kill you. Yes. Yes. 一時間後には着くかと。
Don't you dare faint again. Keep your eyes open. Fuck. We both could use medical attention. Do you know a Ripadoc whom you can trust? I know. Someone. We must get to Ripadoc. Quickly! Victor. Will. Fix. Us. Up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. Did you hear me? All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the service area. Just come pick me up. I need to get to Misty's Esoterica. Front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get him inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Precious tanky! It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing. How is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. You in there? Ah! My head. How you feeling? I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing. And I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage, and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of... hatred. And then I let it all out into a mic, and I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh, I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. 
Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different. Strange. And I hated it. I hated everybody. Every inch. It was too real. Even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Hang on. I mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head. Right now. That's right. Johnny Silverhand. Had his crowning moment about 50 years ago. AHQ bombing. Heard of it? It's his doing. People say he was buried under the rubble. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. You've never given me that look before, Vic. What is it? You, uh... Don't got a lot of time left, kid. Say what now? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much... life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. V, it's important you get all this. You'll fix me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't admit a thing, not one deep. Okay. There was... is a construct. A psyche on the chip. That of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? Low caliber, you lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. Don't just die and get up like nothing happened. Used to be true. Now it's only if they don't have a classified piece of corpo tech primed to resurrect them. What about me? My psyche? I'll make it back from the other side and what? I'm supposed to pretend change is normal? Ask the Arasaka engineers who built the thing. All I know is your mind's gonna go. It won't be pretty. From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out. While your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic. Inevitable. And neither of you can stop it. I remember this thing. Saw it on TV. What was that stupid slogan? Soul something? Secure your soul. But that's it. It's just supposed to let you communicate with constructs. Maybe. But this is a prototype by the look of things. Somehow made it out of Arasaka Labs. 
Can't we just take the chip out? Or switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. And then he died. And I thought I was gonna die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here, got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizine's from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. I gotta lie down. Here, got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep? Misty, wait. Uh, about Jackie. Yeah? He talked about you. Like lots. We got into a fight. Right before he went off to do this job. He wasn't mad at you. I hope you know that. I know. I just wish our last moments together could have been... different. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. Please sleep. Gotta get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way. You included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? How should I know? 
The fuck kind of joint toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! Who you work for? Start talking! Fuck. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait! Never, asshole. Now like that! Stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger! I can feel it. Our minds touch it. I'm like mold on fruit, creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be.
Tajimura here. We must meet. Come to Tom's diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Oh. Danger lurks. Our drama team will be there. Sign up for our platinum plan today because your life is worth it. Nine 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 nine. Drama team. Open up. Forget. Barry, we know you're in there. We're here to help. Don't make me mad. Don't got no fucking war. You know what the worst thing is about this place? About those fights you mentioned. V, V, V! If you don't have a titanium skull lining, you're gonna have memory problems in no time. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you wanna go, put down your eddies, and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight in the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of.
Hey, get back here. You blind? you before, Mama Wells, but uh, you know how it is. You had other important things on your mind. Hmm. Maybe that. What's the matter? I just wanted to know how, you know, you're holding up. No good, be. Parents should not bury their own children. Mira, don't worry. I take care of myself. I suppose you still do what you... What you did before. Just promise me you won't get yourself killed, okay? May he watch over you, mijo. Yesterday? It's all in the report. Oh, I read it.
Zed. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. This is about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. What's it you actually want from me? To begin. You must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You're thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? You ask a lot of questions. You have many interesting things to say. Might be your turn now to say something interesting. I intend to punish Yorinobu Arasaka severely for the crime he has committed. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear. Ah, it's hot. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a poem. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped Arasaka. Betrayed it. Saka scum 
was everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Sabro-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there, Rogue. Mean to say you worked for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the High and Mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Our Sok is still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. 
Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? what I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet... Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Got a good memory for faces. Bar's closed. Sorry, Chu. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Just don't let me catch you messing around, okay? Start again. What is it you want us to do now? Beat some sense into it. 
Listen, that don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I, I don't care. I just want my room back. Your pimp threw you out, that it? Told me I was generating losses, then just said, have a nice life and slam the damn door. I don't got nowhere to sleep tonight. Still got your body, though, don't you? Work it. Don't think I do. Every any I make gets eaten up by upgrades. Where are you going? Nothing to see back Let here. Let it lie. Judy's friend. You done with Abaculio? Yeah. Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? I don't. Must be our rep. Girls need help, they come here. Last time I checked, we weren't running a shelter. Come on, they all deserve a chance. Anyone could end up useful. Give it some time. They'll pay for themselves. Pay? Chicks can barely take care of themselves. You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. I thought I made that clear. Or was I just too subtle for you? V, get it together. Susie seems to know what she wants. Is she your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high, or sink into quicksand. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? I need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist? Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro. I'm sorry. Was I boring you? Caught some lead myself, too. Boo hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Okay, let's just say I'm pretty much fucked. Biochip we clept during the heist is killing me. Albeit slowly. Evie commissioned the job. I know how to stop that. That's why I need to know who hired her. Huh. Let's say I believe you. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. I'd look for her there. Where is that? Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. Luxurious. Let me know how she's doing. Okay. Mm. 
I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. surprised. You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Back to our chat. When do we meet face to face? Never! I don't got a name, don't got a face. To you, I'm Mr. Hands, guy on the phone. Take it or fuck off. Heard that watch has been hanging around. Opened a goddamn gate to hell in that gym. Got those voodoo boys sitting in their running chairs so bad, power use in the whole district dropped by half. You worried? 
Know what keeps the biz flowing, V? The status quo. You ain't got that, biz goes to shit. Next time, don't ask about stuff like that over the phone. How'd you wind up with Pacifica in your hands? Hands? Belong together. I used to be somebody, now I'm under the radar. A lot more going down in Pacifica than people think. And once they do think, it'll be too late. Gotta run. Don't waste any time. Hey, look. Huh. What's this? Would you look at that? You see it too, right? gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Eh, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both. Kaku Akata, Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. <laughs> 